I would plant a poison ivy if I ever had a magic thumb instead of watching that film. Oh man, what a painful movie to watch. Oh, what's up everybody, Chuck Fan Media here, and today I'm going to review and rant on A Troll in Central Park, and it's the seventh feature film from Don Bluth. So this movie mainly tells the story of Stanley, who is a troll with the magic green thumb to bring plants and flowers to life, which is forbidden in the kingdom of trolls, and then the Queen banishes the Stanley into New York City and he ends up being in Central Park. And now the two siblings named Gus and Rosie wanted to get to Central Park. However, they were forbidden by their parents. And now the two children have to sneak out to the Central Park. Rosie discovers a troll and then a secret cave and then goes and Gus goes after Rosie. And now they all have fun each other until Something went wrong. The evil villains named Queen Gnoraga and King Lord went to Central Park and destroyed everything. Gus and Rosie tried to get back home until they got trapped by the evil villains. And now Stanley has to help Rosie and Gus escape from Queen Gnoraga using the dream boat to get back, get them back home. You know what? That's basically what the plot is. So what do I think about this movie? I thought that movie is so dreadful and awful. I felt this movie lacks the faith of Don Bluth animation. The story does not make any sense. Well, I have to admit, Rosie is actually a decent character. She is more adorable in this movie. Stanley is kind of childish and annoying. And Gus? He's actually very irritating. He kept on screaming, Rosie! Oh. And the villain Queen Gnoraga, she is so boring. The ending is so repetitive, like the New York City is being covered in green after Stanley comes back to life. I was like, what the hell? Well, honestly, let's get into the humor. It is so unfunny. And all of the songs, including Absolutely Green, annoyed the living shit out of me. Overall, I have to say, this is Don Blue's first miss of animation. I give a troll in Central Park 0 stars out of 5. Bullshit movie. Well, I still like Don Bluth as he made earlier masterpieces such as The Secret of Nim, Land Before Time, and American Tale and All Dogs Go to Heaven, but it's not his best work. And that's my review and rant on a troll in Central Park. So, hope you guys enjoy, and thanks for watching guys, and I'll, go, I'll see you guys later.